Hello everyone. Today I will show you how to make this snake. It's a pretty good snake. Maybe we have to show you how to make a smaller snake. You can add to it if you want. Here's a showcase. I would say to go on all terrain. And yes, it can flip over. That's why in the video I'm going to show you how to make little stabilizers for it. But still, it can still flip over from the time. But yeah. So without further ado, let's be right into it. So first, I'm going to take a a one four block, a beam, one by four block. Then I'm going to take a regular block. Then I'm going to place a wedge, regular wedge, just like that, right here. Yeah. Five blocks right there, right on top of the last one. Okay, and then I'm going to go over to this thing. Yeah. I'm going to go over to Mount Rose. Uh, oh, wait, no, sorry. I'm going to get another block, place it right there. Get a motor, then I'm going to set it to unpowered. I'm going to do this real quick. This says you all unpowered. Don't have to change anything else. So put it unpowered. I'm going to place it right there. Just like that. Get another one right there. And. So we could actually change that. Okay, we're going to change something up quick. Okay, everything's going to be fine. This the half blocks, regular half block. One right there, right there, then right there, just like that. And then we're going to get another block. And place it another block right here. That's fine. So it's gonna look just like that so far. Just like that. Now, for what I do, let's get to the front. Put your main pilot seat. I don't have any main pilot seat, so we're gonna use the pilot seat. And place it right there, one block away from the wedge. Doesn't really matter where you place it, I'll just put four like that. Then we're gonna go over, get half blocks, just like this half block. I'm gonna flip it upside down, place right there, right there, and right there. Mm, here, right there. I gotta see my mouse. There. Just like that. And then. Next up, don't have to do this right away. We're going to do it a quicker way.
So I'm just going to load it, load it, have it. Place it right there. Yep, that's about right. And another one. Block, block, motor. Then the face. Shoot. Wait. That one's facing that way. It's going to be facing this way. Just like that. Okay, so we're going to do that. Lock, lock, motor. Right. There. Lock, lock, motor. Right there. Lock, lock, motor. Right there. So let's go ahead and copy this. So, right, right there, let me get to the end of the arrow. And if you want, you can make this dongle by yourself. Lock, lock, motor. 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 Yes, I know we made it past a line. It's fine though because we don't have enough space. I'm gonna get blocks right there. Just place them right in front of the half blocks. Quick and easy. Except for my mouse, of course. Then I'm gonna get that right there. Right there. Put red, regular wedges, sorry. Regular wedges, just on the on the regular blocks, not on the half blocks. Regular blocks, not there. Still there, but like not on top. There you go. Now I'm going to get another block, as usual, as the pattern that we were going with. Block, block, move on. So we're going to place that last block. Uh, just like this. Okay. And just like that, we're going to add the motors. Unpower them, that's it. You don't need to put it on this last one because that last one will count. Well, well, you only have to put it on the, this one right here if you want to make a dongle. Okay, then we're going to go back right over to here. Place it like that. Just like this. And this, these are regular motors that we're placing down. One right there. Wait. I'm forgetting. Okay, like this. Just like this. Right under the other motors. Just like that. I'm going to flip it. So it looks just like this. And place it right there. Um, we're going to have to fix this after. We're going to place them just like this. Now back to that one that we're going to fix. 
gonna get rid of this half block and place a regular block then place another half block regular block right here then i'm gonna place a half block just right there just like that just like that on the side of the motor then back to the front we're gonna add a propeller Just like that. So I add two right onto the wedges. The settings are fine just how they are. Go and place another right there. Then one right there. Then for the wedge right here, I'm going to place increase power A and P for decrease power. P is like on the other side of your keyboard, so you will not be pressing that because it's so far away from the hands where it actually is then on and off mode same thing with the other one just this one's going to be D okay. and there you have it now let's go ahead and test it looks like they work and they should down the little slow because I have it longer than this one you can add more length to it just by copying how I showed you to do the little line things. But yes, this can go all on all train. And just like that, you have your very own little snake. Easy, simple, I made this video because other snakes, like you look up snake, it's going to bring up the big ones or ones that can't like go on, on all train. Yeah, you just want a normal snake that can go on all terrain, not too long to make. But yeah, that's the tutorial for today. Hope you guys enjoy. And yeah, stay tuned for the next one. Bye!